Hello Mango! Today we are going to do a gentle stretching Pilates workout with all the dynamic active stretch movement to help you stretch your whole body and increase the mobility and flexibility in the most comfortable way. So if you're ready, just roll your mat. Let's do this together. Hey love, you got your heart on your sleeve but the shirt on your back's a bit small. Changing the world ain't half bad after all. All right, now let's start with sitting comfortable on the mat and feel free to bend your knees, open your legs if it feels easier for the hips. Lengthen the spine, hands on the knees, gently pull the belly button in and relax your shoulders. Take a deep inhalation through the nose and exhale deeply through your mouth. Awesome. Now I wanted to allow yourself to keep your hands down, relax. Your shoulders rotate fully to four directions. And three more rounds. And then reverse. And five, four, three, two, and one. Now, bring the chin to the chest, look down to your feet. Feel the back of your neck is stretching and feel free to use your hand to put on the head if you feel like it will feel better with a stretch on the neck. Start to bring your head to the left and then to the right and come back and couple more times each side move slowly inhale and exhale listen to the range of motion that the neck allow you to do and to the left to the right back to the center and bring your hands down on the knees again bring the head to one side feel the side of your neck is stretching and to the opposite side and four more times slowly three two and last one back to the center, open your arm to the side, lean on one side to do side bending, lengthen your arm, do it slowly, come back to the opposite side, go a little bit further if you can, and back to the center, four more times each side, inhale, lengthen, and exhale, come back to the center. Inhale to the opposite side. Exhale, come back to the center. Lengthen the arm and bring your opposite knee further away. So that way you feel more stretching on the side of your body. Really listen to your body and do everything slowly. Good. And last one. to the other side and slowly back to the center I hope you feel good so now inhale rotate your torso to one side come back to the opposite side and back to the center do it with your own breath inhale rotate exhale back inhale to the other side and exhale back to the center three more times each side Two. Last one. And now rotate the wrist and reverse. One more time. And 
the reverse. Reach your hand to one side, let someone pulling your hand away from the shoulder and to the opposite side. And come back four more times each side. Again, do it really slowly with your own breath. Inhale. And exhale. Very good. Feel your whole arms and shoulders lengthening. And two. And last one. And slowly bring your torso back to the center, hands on the knee. Gently shake your hips, take a deep breath, and inhale deeply through your nose. Exhale deeply through your mouth. I hope that you already feel the difference after just a couple of minutes. Now I wanted to allow yourself to arch your back, cat and cow in sitting position. And then round your spine, chin to chest, pull the belly button all the way in. Inhale, articulate. Keep your shoulders down far away from the ears. Exhale, each vertebra at a time, chin to the chest. Look to the ankles. And one couple more times. Good. Do it slowly. Exhale when you round your spine. And inhale when you arch your back. Really do it slowly so you're gonna feel the spine moving each vertebra at a time. The best way to aware the body and mind and feel the harmony is just do it slowly and really focus on each part of your body. And round. And back to the center, gently. Take a deep inhalation. Exhale deeply through your mouth. All right, now for the next movement, I wanted to allow yourself to come to sit along the mat. So, inhale and bend one knee to the front and one leg backward. You can start to grab the pillow here and rest your body down. Just rest your head down and feel good here. You can try to gently shake your hips. And if you want to make it easier for the hips, you can also bend your knee in the back. So that way you have more space with the hips. Gently shake your hips, take a deep breath, inhale deeply through your nose, and exhale deeply through your mouth. Good. And if you feel like you want even more stretch at the hips, you can just bring the pillow out and then bring your whole body down to the mat. Gently shake the hips here, inhale deeply through the nose, and exhale deeply through your mouth. It feels so good at the hips. Awesome. And now slowly come back. Switch to the opposite side. And again, grab the pillow if you need to. Lengthen your leg. Gently shake your hips from left to right. Or bend the knee just like the other side if you feel easier with that. And again. Take a deeper level, but let the pillow out and gently shake your hips. Take a deep breath, inhale deeply and exhale deeply. Awesome. And now I wanted to allow yourself to come back. Lengthen your legs, open your legs a bit apart. Flex the ankle, arms to the front, shoulders down. And now inhale slowly, round your spine. Flex forward towards the ankle and then come back slowly, lengthen the spine and round, move forward and then come back. Now you can try to go a little bit further if you feel that your body allow you to listen to your lower back and go really slow here because you want to do it slowly and with control and then come back. Just slide your hands when it gets down to the mat, gently all the way. If you feel like it's good, you can also try to bend the knees 
to go even further if it helps with the hips and the lower back. So listen to your body. We want to feel good on the stretch. So come back, round. Exhale forward and inhale back, lengthen. And three more times. Two. And last one. And slowly bring it back to the center. Gently shake your hips, take a deep breath. Inhale deeply through your nose. Exhale deeply through your mouth. Now flex the ankle, open your arm to the side. Rotate the torso to one side, flex forward to the opposite ankle. Come back to the opposite side. And inhale, bring it back nine more times with your own breath. Eight. Keep breathing. The saw. Seven. And six. You can round your spine if it's easier for your lower back. Listen to your body. Five. And four. Valley button all the way in. Three. And two. And last one. And slowly bring it back to the center. Gently shake your hips, take a deep breath. Inhale deeply through your nose. And exhale deeply through your mouth. Now bend your knees. And slowly slide towards the hips as close as you can. Now feel free to use the pillow anytime to sit on it if you feel like it's easier for the hips so keep the feet together and make a little pose and then slowly walk forward so feel your hips are stretching you can put your whole forearms down to the mat if you feel like it's good gently bring the hips from left to right very tiny movement but you feel great on the stretch on the hips and then slowly walk your hands to the left if you feel fancy and if you feel like your body allow you to or the range of movement of your body allow you to walk all the way back so your hands go to the opposite knee but really slowly and listen to your body don't force yourself and then come back to the center again gently shake your hips and to the right And then again, walk over your opposite ankle if you feel good. And slowly come back to the center. All right. And now I'm going to allow yourself to bring the pillow to one side again. Now this time, inhale and lengthen one leg. Flex the ankle. Your, opposite, your hands go behind the hips, close the elbows. And then slowly, your opposite leg, just put it on top. Good. And pull it towards the knee. So you feel the ankle is stretching, the back of your knee is a bit stretching here. And then come back to the other side, not the ankle, but the back, the bottom of your foot. And then the back of your knee is stretching, lift your heel off the mat. And then come back to the center. Open your knees wide, close and your feet at the same time. Your whole legs. Good. And now I wanted to come to lie all the way down on the mat. Now again, you can keep your head on the pillow if you feel like it's more comfortable for you. <laughs> all right. Now bend one knee to the chest and lengthen your opposite leg. Rotate the ankle. And then reverse. And to the opposite side. And reverse. Now bring both legs to the chest. Start to wiggle your hips gently 
Open your arms to the side, lengthen your legs up and your opposite legs up. Extend the ankle and then flex and extend and flex and extend again and flex. Awesome. And a couple more times with your own breath. You can use your hand to hug the thighs here if it feels easier for you to keep your legs lengthening. Good. And now slowly flex the ankle, open your toes and keep your heels together to the V later and then come back. Reverse V, open and close and open and come back and three more times here with your own breath. Two and last one. And now extend the ankle. Pull your legs towards the chest. Flex the ankle. And now if you can soften the knees, use your hand to grab your and your toes and lengthen one leg and come back to the other side and back to the center. I'm going to try to do it for four more times with your own breath. Three. You can pause a little bit longer if you need to. Two. And last one. And slowly hug your knees to your chest. Gently wiggle the hips again. And now slowly hug your ankles with your hands, open your knees wide. Bring your hips from left to right. Kind of give your lower back a little massage here. Now lengthen one leg and come back and lengthen to the opposite and bring it back and four more times each side. And last one. And slowly rotate the angle and reverse. If you can try to lengthen both legs at the same time, use your hand to hug the angle and start to bring your legs from left to right. If it's easier for you by hugging your thighs and bend the knees and bring your legs from left to right. You can also do that. So listen to your body. Slowly. And back to the center. Close the knees. Open your arm to the side. And then bring both legs to one side. Look to the opposite one. And come back to the other side. Your opposite shoulder blade spreads down to the mat. I'm going to try to do a couple more times each side here. Slowly. Inhale. And exhale. And three. I love stretching Pilates workout because I feel like I learn a lot. Especially about patience. As we need to do uh, things slower and all the breath really help with that take a deep inhalation through the nose and exhale deeply through your mouth and of course it's bring deep relaxation to this one when you focus deeply on your breath and last one to the left last one to the right and back to the center feet down arms along the body Open your legs a bit apart. Draw your hips all the way up to the bridging. And then come back slowly each vertebra at a time. And four more times you get your own breath. Three. Inhale. And exhale. And two. And last one. 
gently shake your hips, take a deep breath, inhale deeply through your nose, and exhale deeply through your mouth. Open your arms to the side, open your legs to the side, and make a little pulse here. Good. And slowly close the knees, lengthen one leg, flex the ankle, and extend, and flex, and extend. Now lift your arms up, reach your shoulders up and down. Shoulder blades off the mat and back. And three, two, and last one. And switch to the opposite side. Again, flex the ankle and extend. And arms up, shoulders up and down. Hands over your head. And now I want to keep your arms just face up to the ceiling. Arch your back, pull the belly button in and then bring your chin to the chest. Look to the knees. And then come back, bring your arms back along the body and your back back to neutral position. Gently shake your hips, take a deep inhalation through the nose. Exhale deeply through your mouth. Allow yourself to come to find a comfortable position when you're lying down. And we are going to do some meditation today on this position. And you feel free to go up and sit across the legs if it feels more comfortable and easier to focus for you. Otherwise, I would suggest to just indulge yourself a little bit with this meditation of lying down on the mat. So you can keep your arms along the body or bring your hands on top of your belly, whatever way that makes you feel good. Shoulders relax. Inhale deeply through the nose. Exhale deeply through your mouth. Now bring the focus into the head and go and start to aware of each body part in your body at this moment and see how do you feel on each part of your body from the head through the cheek through the chin the neck the shoulders gently adjust it if you ever need to to feel good at that part of your body and go all the way down slowly through your chest, your belly button, your hips, your lower back. Gently adjust the hips. Again, back to the position where you feel comfortable. Go up to your thighs, your knees, your calf, your ankle. Wiggle your ankles a little bit if you need to adjust it. And again, inhale deeply through the nose and exhale deeply through your mouth. Put your hands on the rib cage. Inhale. You feel the rib cage clearly more than before. And then exhale, the rib cage blend into the stomach, the tummy. Inhale deeply and exhale deeply inhale through the nose and exhale through your mouth inhale get all the air into the side in the back of your body and exhale get all the air out of your lungs inhale again and exhale deeply and just stay here for a couple minutes to meditate with the harmony
and let's welcome us to this five minute body and mind harmony meditation find a comfortable seated position or you also can lie down ensuring that your spine is straight and you feel relaxed close your eyes take a few deep breaths inhale deeply through your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth. Now gently bring your attention to your breath. Notice the cool air entering your nostril as you inhale and the warm air leaving your body as you exhale. Allow your breath to flow naturally without any effort. As you continue to breathe, visualize a warm golden light entering your body with each inhale. This light represents harmony, peace and balance. Imagine this light filling your entire body, starting at the crown of your head and slowly moving down to your toes. Feel the warmth of the golden light as it envelops your entire being, connecting your mind, body and spirit. As you exhale, release any tension, stress, negative thoughts that you may be holding on to. Allow the harmony within you to grow stronger with each breath. Now bring your attention to the heart center. Feel the warmth of love radiating from your heart. And as you breathe in, imagine this love expanding throughout your entire body. Notice how your body, mind and spirit are all connected and working in harmony. Take a moment to express gratitude for this beautiful connection within you. Thank your body for its strength and resilience, your mind for its wisdom and clarity, and your spirit for its guidance and intuition.
As we near the end of this meditation, take a few more deep breaths, continuing to nourish the harmony within you. Take this feeling of harmony and balance with you throughout your day and remember that your mind, body and spirit are all connected and working together to support your well-being. So much love to you. And now bring your focus back to your breath. Take a deep inhalation through the nose. And exhale deeply through your mouth. Inhale. And exhale deeply. And slowly wiggle your hands, your feet, your hips and your shoulders and whenever you're ready slowly open your eyes allow yourself to lean on one side to sit up And we just complete our meditation and stretching playlist today. I hope you enjoyed it and I'm going to see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.